The broadcast is now starting. All attendees are in listen-only mode. Hello and welcome to this amazing webinar about Cisco CCI certifications, scope and career growth. My name is Vikas Kumar and uh, I am the founder and uh, MD of Network Bulls Group and uh, I have done my CCIE in three forms. I did my CCIE in routing switching, security and voice. And uh, other than having three CCIEs, I have more than 14 years of ex industry experience where I worked with uh, many of the top companies like uh, Riley Gear, CSS Corp and IDS Infotech. And that's where I learned a lot about uh, networking, about routing, switching, firewalls, security, and uh, voice networks. So, we started Network Bulls in uh, year 2009, and uh, since then it has been an amazing journey. It's been a pleasure to work with uh, so many students, and I this journey would not have been possible without the amazing support from the student community and of course from a great team that we have here in-house. Well, before we move ahead, let's discuss something about uh, the facts about Network Bulls. So, I feel uh, proud to announce that we have world's largest Cisco training labs which is a huge lab we have dedicated more than 10,000 square feet area for the lab only the lab includes all kind of uh, racks which have routers switches firewalls IP phones IPS and so many other devices so this is one of the huge labs available and uh, not only in terms of devices, the ambience of the lab, the environment in the lab is amazing. It, it provides, great, provides great energy. Our students can learn from the fellow students. They can learn from the trainers in the lab. So it gets a great environment of uh, learning and studying. Plus the benefit is that the lab is available 24 by 7, which means you can come into the lab and practice any time of the day at the night, Saturday, Sunday, any holiday, the lab is always up open. So anyone can access the racks or the lab facilities anytime, whenever they want. And I feel proud uh, in announcing that we have trained more than 11,000 students in the last six years and uh, students have been coming from all over the world to us. So. It, it's a great pleasure to, to train so many students and I feel proud about it. And uh, we have done some record breaking placements in uh, year 2015. So we have placed more than 3000 students in year 2015. So which in itself has been a great achievement. And uh, we offer, we, we have placed all our uh, training uh, students who are uh, who are enrolled with us in CCI or who have done CCI with us. So our placement record in CCI has been more than 100%. And uh, the good thing is that 80% of the placements has been done without even uh, students going for any of the CCI exams, which means our focus is more on the quality training rather than uh, the CCI exams or CCI examinations. So. We always make sure that the students get the quality training so that they get placed even without the CCA exams. And our efforts have been recognized uh, from time to time and uh, recently also we have got one more award where we were awarded as the most promising Cisco and uh, Microsoft training company with the proven placement record in 2015 and I felt uh, privileged to receive this award on behalf of Network Bulls. 
these are some of the placement stories that uh, we would like to share with you so it has been an amazing year for us so we, we place so many students in uh, various companies including many multinational companies and uh, whether it is a male candidate or female candidate we placed every candidate and it it, it was a great achievement by the placement team and by the student community and uh, our cca results in uh, 2015 have been really amazing so many of our indian and international students cleared their cca exams in 2015 including female candidates as well so which means the learning has no boundary anyone can learn from anywhere and can pass the exam and get a great job and uh, more than uh, 90% uh, people cleared their CCIE in first attempt who trained with us. So that uh, itself is a great achievement. And uh, I feel uh, proud to announce that uh, Netwebulls is a Cisco learning partner. So which means all the trainings that we provide are uh, authorized by Cisco and as well as we have uh, Microsoft partnership. So we are Microsoft Silver Learning Partner. Okay, the agenda for the webinar for the today is that we will discuss a lot about uh, CCIE as a career, different CCIE Cisco certification tracks, world's most demanded CCA tracks and then uh, job placement guarantee and training programs and finally we will wrap it up with uh, the Q&A session. Now uh, CCIE as a career. Most of the people college growing, going graduates or even people who have done their graduation have really no idea that CCIE can be taken as a full-time career option. Most of the people, when they think about networking, they think uh, about, they only know about CCNA or uh, they think that networking is something related to the hardware, but they hardly have no idea. They have hardly any idea that CCIE is a full-time career option and uh, it should be taken very, very seriously. Now, People who do not know about CCIE, I would like to tell you that uh, CCIE is uh, one of the world's most prestigious and uh, globally recognized certification. So people over, all over the world who knows about networking knows about CCIE and their, the CCIE's value as well. And uh, why CCIE has uh, such a great value is only because uh, the demand is really high and the supply is really low. So there are more than 5 lakh CCIE certified engineers required right now and uh, there are hardly around 40,000 CCIEs available. So this means there's a huge gap in demand and supply and that's, there, that's why the value is there. So someone who has done CCIE is considered as uh, having a good knowledge. So the demand is obviously going to be there so and the demand is going to grow as more and more company are uh, companies are setting up their networks so cci is is going to have a huge huge value in the in the world and uh, this is a golden time for people to do ccie so any cci you do it's going to pay off really really well now once you just choose to uh, do CCIE, there are uh, seven different tracks from which you need to choose that you would like to pursue. So <clears throat> first of all, you have uh, CCI routing and switching, which is always the base of any network. So most of the people go for CCI routing and switching as their first CCIE. Well, there are many reasons for this. First is uh, there is easy availability of the resources whether it is the training institutes or uh, the study material or the uh, fellow students so cci routing and switching the resources are available easily plus 
there has always been a great demand for CCA R&S engineers and it will always be there as uh, C routing and switching forms the base of all other technologies. So whether it is security, data center, voice, any other technology has to be based on routing and switching only. So that's why many people go for CCA routing and switching as their first CCIE and the demand is always have been there and it is the demand is always going to be there. Now the next is CCI security. It's again one of the best CCIE to pursue for as as far as the pre pressures are concerned. So I will talk about a lot uh, about security in the later slides. Then you can go for CCI voice or CCI collaboration, which is named right now. CCI voice is for people who have interest in uh, voice technologies, IP telephony technologies, collaboration technologies. So this is again a CCIE which it is in demand but not as much in demand as CCI routing and switching and security engineers. But yes it is there in the demand but uh, if we compare it with routing and switching and security yes the CCI voice is a bit more difficult to do or tougher to do so that's why not many people go for cci voice these days and then we have fourth cci data center cci data center is also very famous these days especially because of the content that it covers so anyone who is willing to learn about cisco nexus switches Cisco Nexus Technologies, Data Center Technologies should go for uh, Data Center, CCI Data Center Training. But yeah, the demand is also there. But the only thing is, uh, one, it is more difficult to do as compared to routing and switching and security. And two, the not many resources are, are available for CCI Data Center Training. And... Uh, it's also uh, not the the first choice for uh, freshers when it comes to experienced candidates yes cci data center is one of the obvious choice and then we have uh, fifth cci cci wireless so cci wireless is a ccie which is uh, preferable only to those candidates who have interest in wireless technologies or who are already working in the wireless technologies uh, not a lot of demand available for CCI wireless engineers because uh, not every company needs uh, CCI wireless setup or wireless engineers. And uh, sixth is CCI service provider, which is again for people who are into service provider technologies or who are willing to go into service provider technologies. So if somebody wants to learn about MPLS, about BGP, about advanced service level protocol, service provider level protocols, then he should go for CCI service provider. But again, this is an option for uh, experienced people only uh, because nobody will give a chance to freshers to work in service provider industry. So people who have at least two to three years of experience should go for service provider not as a fresher and the demand is limited to service provider companies only uh, the demand is not for uh, available in every company actually then the seventh ccie is uh, ccde which is cisco certified design expert this is a certification which is pursued by people who have uh, more than five years of experience, people who uh, want to willing who are willing to become uh, CC, uh, c c architects and uh, solution consultants. For basically, this is a CCI for highly experienced people only, so not a good option as a fresher. Now. Let's talk about the most demanded CCA tracks. And uh, obviously, two CCIEs stand out in this case CCA routing switching and CCA security. And then we'll talk about uh, multi vendor technology expert program as well, which is designed in house by Network Bulls. 
Now, when you talk about CCIE routing and switching, it is the highest level of uh, certification when it comes to routing and switching technologies. So, people who do do CCIE routing and switching, they work on routers and switches. They learn about various routing protocols, switching protocols. So, they learn how to design in the network installation and manage managing the network. So. And there's a huge demand available when it comes to CCI routing and switching engineers. The demand is always going to be there because every company needs a routing and switching setup and every company needs a routing and switching engineer. So that's why the demand is there and demand is always going to grow in future. So this is one of the best CCIs to pursue as a fresher and also for experienced people many people go for ccie routing and switching even when they have working experience of two three five years so this is one of the best ccis now once you choose to do CC your cci routing and switching then the path is very simple you need to go for from uh, ccna routing and switching which is where you learn about the basics of networking you learn about different uh, routing protocols different switching protocols and uh, basics of uh, networking like osi model tcp ip model ip addressing and subnetting and so on then you move to the next level this is where you do your ccnp routing and switching this is where you learn about a uh, next level of routing and switching protocols so you focus dedicatedly on uh, one module at a time so ccnp has three module routing switching and t-shoot and then finally you go for ccie routing and switching this is where you learn the expert level of uh, routing and switching protocols and you get a great knowledge of uh, routing and switching technologies once you reach at ccie level and once you are done with your CCI training, you are eligible for different job roles like network engineer, senior network engineer, network administrator. It all depends how much experience you have or you are a fresher or uh, how much knowledge you have gained throughout your CCIE routing and switching training journey. And as we mentioned, you will learn a lot about how to work on different models of routers and switches you will learn about network designing network implementation network troubleshooting so network designing here means that if you are given a requirement that okay you have to set up a network of 500 users so you know how to set it up you know how to troubleshoot the network you know how to configure the network you know how to configure the routers and switches and different technologies that are used in routers and switches now when we talk about salary packages there are uh, the, the, the there's a good career growth available so your package grows slowly and slowly up to a very good level so it depends how much experience you have so accordingly you will get a very very good package even the starting package has been really good so you initially you get somewhere around four to six lakhs package it all depends how much knowledge you have gained through throughout your training journey now apart from cci routing and switching the other very famous cci is uh, cci security it's uh, one of the highest level of certification when it comes to security technology or security track and uh, this has been my personal favorite over the last many years because it uh, it has many advantages that uh, no other cci has so now why cci security has become so important the reason is very simple that network security has become the requirement of each and every company these days no company can survive uh, without having a secure network these days because as we know that uh, with the invention of internet every network is open to threats from external world from the internet so 
that's why it becomes very very important to secure the network and to make sure that the network is up and running 24 by 7 and uh, as CCA security certification or CCA security track is not very old so still very very less people have uh, their expertise in security technologies and uh, the demand has been really really high and it is going to grow a lot in the future as well so that's where the demand is and as you can see uh, the industry needs more than 2 lakh CCA security engineers and uh, there are hardly 6,000 CCA security engineers available worldwide right now. So this is a huge demand and the demand is going to grow as more and more attacks are be being invented every day. So networks are being under constant threat now. So the security becomes very very important in all the networks. Now the path to CCIE security, it starts from uh, CCNA routing and switching where you learn the basics of networking, then you move to CCNP routing and switching where you learn the next level of routing and switching and uh, then we start with uh, the security journey, we start with CCNA security. This where we learn about uh, various uh, types of attacks, various types of security devices, how to implement the basic level of security, how to work on a firewall and how to set up a basic VPN. Then you move to the next level which is CCNP security. This is where you learn about the next level of security and finally you leave, uh, move to CCI security. This is where you learn each and everything about firewalls about vpn technologies about wireless security about email security web security so that's where you you learn, learn each and everything so as you can see the path starts with routing and switching from ccna to ccnp and then it moves to security from ccna to cci security and uh, once you are done with your uh, CCI security training you will be eligible for uh, different job roles like network security engineer, senior network security engineer, network administrator. So it all depends how much experience you are carrying accordingly you will uh, get your desired profile. Now why CCI security is such a famous CCIE throughout the world? Well the first reason is, as we mentioned, it's a combination of uh, CCI routing and switching and security knowledge. So, once you go through your CCI security training, you learn the CC, uh, routing and switching up to CCNP level and then you learn your security in in-depth. So, it's a deadly combination. So, any requirement where you have you need a CCI route, uh, you need a routing and switching engineer or you need a security engineer. So you fulfill both the requirements in any case. So you become a complete package because you can take care of the routing and switching part also and you can take care of the security part also because you have learned both domains throughout your training. And because you have more knowledge, so which means you will be eligible for more job roles, whether it is network engineer, network administrator, network security engineer, network security administrator, you are always going to be the first choice when it comes to deciding or choosing the right candidate and uh, because you have uh, the knowledge of multiple technologies or at least two technologies so obviously you are going to experience a higher career growth as compared to any other ccie and uh, obviously which means that you will get higher pay packages as well And once you are done with your CCI security or throughout your CCI security journey, you will be mastering many, many technologies. Uh, first of all, you are going to learn a lot about VPNs, virtual private networks, how to set up VPNs through different firewalls, different routers. And uh, you will you learn how to set up your AAA authorization accounting and uh, you will learn how to use ACS server and uh, I server. You will learn the 
multiple layers of uh, setting a defense using IPS, firewalls, routers and switches. You will learn about email security, web security using WSA web security appliance. You will learn about wireless security as well. And you will learn about many uh, devices as well, such as routers, switches, firewalls, IPS, WSA, which is also called Iron Port. You will also learn about uh, Cisco I server, which is Identity Service Engine for authentication, authorization, and accounting. And uh, you will also learn how to implement IP phone security, VoIP security. And then there are uh, different. Uh, salary packages that you are going to expect according to your knowledge and ex according to the number of experience you have in years so this is huge uh, growth available when you go for cci security or uh, security training now apart from uh, cc routing and switching and security then we have our in-house program designed which is also called multi-vendor technology expert this is a combination which has been specifically created keeping in the demand keeping the demand in mind of the industry where uh, we teach multiple technologies in this course as the name suggests that it's a multi-vendor technology expert which means that we are going to teach you multiple technologies related to multiple vendors so this also has been a great course and it teaches a lot about various technologies so the journey starts with the ccna routing and switching so once you are done with your ccna routing and switching then we move to the next step which is ccnp routing and switching so first of all we build your base using routing and switching training and then we start teaching you the other advanced technologies such as um, cisco asa firewalls cisco vpns how to set up different types of vpns then we will also talk about uh, juniper net screen firewall then we'll talk about palo alto firewall checkpoint firewall so we cover different different firewall methodologies so which means that you will have a mastery over multiple firewalls or multiple security technologies in addition to this we will uh, cover the advanced bgp mpls training which will help you in your service provider network as well and also the nexus training since nexus switches training and then uh, f5 load balancer so and then also apart from this we will cover uh, cloud technologies also network monitoring tools as well and ticketing tools as well so this becomes a great combination of multiple technologies so by the time you are done with this course you are armed with such a great knowledge of various technologies that uh, you can get easily placed in any of the companies who are looking for a multi-talented uh, network engineer so this is one of the best courses that uh, nb has designed and we have seen a great response from the student community from about this course and uh, even uh, companies have been uh, talking to us that uh, we need people who have done multi-vendor technology expert course because we get people who are uh, multi-trained and multi-talented so it's been an amazing amazing course and also network bulls provides 100 percent written job guarantee for its ccie courses and we are the only training institute in india who does so and why we are so sure about our placements or about placement guarantee is because we have a dedicated team working in the placements and they are always generating new openings and getting the interviews conducted for the students but the the main reason for our record breaking placement has been the way we train our students our training methodology so not only do we train our student on the technologies which is related to routing and switching security or any other technologies but also other than these uh, technology training we provide them many other training as well such as uh, cv writing 
skills common interview questions taking care taking uh, your presentation and mock interviews so it makes it makes a great combination so we provide uh, so many pd classes as well so ultimately we make you ready for the job placement so which means that you become a great combination when you go to the industry not only you have great great technology skills you have great uh, communication skills as well by the time you reach to the industry now there are many programs which are offered by netwebbles so we provide 100% job guarantee programs such as uh, multi vendor technology experts cc routing and switching integrated cc security integrated cc collaboration integrated and then there are uh, other training courses also which we have so which you can find more on our website so that's all uh, for the webinar now we will move up to the question and answer round so you can go ahead and ask your questions one by one and i'll try to answer all of the questions one by one so Uh, Amit, you can go ahead and ask your question. Amit Sharma. Hello. Yeah, hello. Hello, Amit. Yeah, my my voice is audible to you. Yes, yes, it is audible. So actually, uh, uh, I'm just planning to go for the CCI security. Mm -hmm. So I recently heard that you launched a new uh, intensive program. Mm -hmm. uh, but I want to join in weekend class. Okay. So, uh, can we uh, train for like in in your intensive uh, program? You okay. are doing like lab also there, mm -hmm. uh, PD also there for mm -hmm. personal development. But I see that in weekend classes, only theory classes is going on. Mm -hmm. Yes, you're right. Actually, so, uh, so we do not uh, we, we do not provide intensive training classes for the weekend student. Uh, this facility is only available for uh, full time students or for the weekday students only. So uh, this facility is obviously not there in weekend classes. So what about the weekend guys? Because suppose if, suppose I'm going for for pay, pay, uh, such a huge payment. Uh, so also I'm uh, wanted to eligible for that kind of service. Yeah, I agree with you. The, the only thing is uh, this is a facility that is only intended for people who are not working somewhere or who are looking for a job. So this uh, intensive training program helps them to sharp their skills, to sharpen their skills in terms of theoretical training, practical training, communication skills. So in weekends obviously it is not possible because we get only two days so this practical and training and pd training okay. needs a lot of rhythm actually so we cannot uh, achieve a lot in two days and what about the job guarantee suppose i'm going to take a, a cci security mm -hmm. so is it possible you uh, going to allow my, my me for the uh, this job guarantee means yes, I'm eligible see. for the yes yes uh -huh. uh, see Amit uh, as I can interact with you I can already feel that you have good communication skills so anyhow uh, there is nothing there's not a lot of challenge that you're going to face when you're going for the placement so I think it would be easy for you to get placements anyhow you just need to get knowledge from us Sure, sure. Even I am planning for that, and I think in uh, next weekend I I think I go for that. Mm -hmm. uh, even I am working professional in uh, networking, but mm -hmm. I want my ultimate dream is to become a CCI. So that's why uh, I'm I'm living in Noida. So Noida to Gurugram, I uh, I it's very hard for me, but I can understand. I can, but I can, see. Uh, for now, yes, I can keep this in mind for future that we might launch this intensive training model for the weekend students also. But for now, this facility is only available for weekday students only. Because, because we need that. Because why I'm saying because, 
why I am saying that bus transit development development class we also need. I understand. Because I there understand. There is a lot of guys. But yeah. uh, the the only thing is it needs a lot of rhythm actually. So two days in a week might not be enough for, to do this. So that's why we offer this in uh, weekdays classes only. So once you have raised this point, so I would certainly. Uh, think about it and we will uh, try to accommodate weekend students also and one more question I have yes see uh, pre previously I visited network bull so that that time you were supported a video training also means you will you was provided a video also to the student mm -hmm. but I have a concern like uh, my office is uh, open in in First Saturday, uh, uh, first Saturday and last mm -hmm. Saturday of the month. Mm -hmm. So in that time, uh, I would not be available for the class. So uh, that time, video will be very uh, helpful for me. But now you are not provided the video. So is there, is there any chance for video? Means uh, you are planning to uh, relaunch this kind of things. Well, uh, we can certainly think about it. The, there were some practical reasons. That's why we had to stop this video recording. So people, uh, students were uh, not taking things very seriously. They were sleeping in the classes. They were not coming into the classes regularly. So it was uh, increasingly uh, becoming difficult for the trainers also to make sure that they are really delivering quality training because not many students were serious at that time because everybody thought that no matter what we even if we miss the class or even if we are using mobile phones in the class or we are sleeping in the class we are on only anyhow get, uh, going to get the video so that was the main reason for us to stop it because and to be very frank uh, since we have stopped this video recording our attendance has improved now. People are more serious in the classroom. They are uh, they are learning things more seriously now. So that's why we had to stop this video recording. I hope you are getting okay, my so point, what, or you are able to understand so what I'm I, saying. I, 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 I'm getting your point, but what about us? Means because we are not able to join uh, the Saturday class. Means so maybe we can we can we can we can record the session for the weekend classes. So we can yeah, certainly work on this. Yeah, because I'm going to pay a huge amount, so I can expect from your side that you also support us. See, and I'm this not is the committing. major reason I'm we are going to join the net. Yeah, yes, I'm, I'm not committing anything on this, but yes, we can certainly work on this. Mm -hmm. We can certainly think about it. Think about it, sir, because it's going to help us a lot. Because I decided to join the Natural Bulls, and within with next week I can join. I am so getting your point. I can getting your. I am getting your point. Why okay. we might work on this? Yeah, sure, sir. Right? Uh, yeah, sure, sure, sir. Okay, sir. Thank you so much. All right. Welcome, Amit. Okay. Thank you. Harpreet. Harpreet? Harpreet, can you hear me? Harpreet? Hello. Uh, Richard? Hello. Yes. 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 Uh, hi, Vika, sir. This is Rishabh calling from Nada. Yes, sir. Uh, hello. Yes. I had a uh, I had a question in my mind that uh, if I'm not able to, uh, I missed any class. Uh, I just uh, listened to the conversation of uh, Amit uh, recently. Mm -hmm. I was just curious that if I missed any class, uh, so how? I mean, uh, am I going to get any extra classes or uh, as is? that a video we can you can arrange for that but uh, I was uh, wondering if I myself, uh, if I if I can get recover that class if I missed by any chance okay so Rishabh uh, it works like this so See, obviously, it becomes very difficult to give a full-fledged class again. Suppose if the weekend class is for three hours, so it becomes difficult right, to right. arrange a three-hour class again. 
what what we can do is or what we normally do or what we what students normally do is we have many batches running on at the same time uh, if you missed a session in your current class so you might join a session in some other classes so because uh, once you are a netobulls member you become a member of for the lifetime so you can join uh, any batch any time so you can repeat uh, okay, the batch okay. and number of time even in the other class is uh, other okay, timing okay. also uh, okay okay sir thank you and uh, there was another thing yes uh, if i am going for a, uh, actually currently i am preparing for the ccna certification so i have completed my ccna here mm -hmm. uh, but i am planning for cci from the network goals only mm -hmm. uh, so thing is that i am just want to know that uh, if i'm getting certified in ccna and after that i'm getting training for ccnp mm -hmm. uh, can i switch back uh, can i switch to security ccna uh, from the i mean without having certification of ccnp uh, routing and such so you want to go for ccna security without going for ccnp uh, routing and switching certification right routing and switching Right, right. But having uh, with having a training, uh, I mean, uh, I will be having a proper training for routing and searching CCNP, but uh, not the general certification. Yeah, so you you don't need to go for certification. So knowledge itself is enough. So you can just make sure that you have good knowledge of CCNP routing and switching. You can go for CCNP security after that. No need of any certification. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Venkat. Hello. Yes, Venkat. Hello. Uh, good evening, sir. Good evening. Uh, hi. I have a little confusion about your uh, MBT course and the CCA security course. Yes. Yes. Please tell me. I am interested in security course, security track. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, MBT course covers a lot of uh, other vendor security technologies. Mm -hmm. What is your recommendation? <laughs> See, both the courses are equally good, so it would be difficult to recommend one particular course. Or I want to say is that if you have interest in um, Cisco CCI security technologies, then obviously CCI security is the first choice. But then if you have the interest in learning multi-vendor technology, then you should go for multi-vendor. But both the courses are equally important, equally good. So it's very difficult to differentiate between the two. So it just, it all boils down to your interest, nothing else. Otherwise they are apple to apple in everything. Okay, thank you, sir. Right. So I would not be the right person to com comment on this. You just need to find out your own passion in this. Okay. Right. Irene. Irene. Hello. Yeah, Irene. Hello. Yes. Yeah, uh, hello. Hello. Yes, yes. Uh, good afternoon, sir. I'm Hiren Swani from Vada. Yes, yes, please. Hello. Yes, sir. I'm just having one confusion, sir. Uh, may I know the total duration for the course for CCI security? Uh, it's normally 10 months. Hello. Yeah, the duration is normally 10 months for CCI security. Okay, uh, it includes all things, uh, I mean uh, theoretical as well as uh, practical? Yes, yes, because uh, we offer the training in 8 hours a day model. So, so you have theory, practical and PD classes in the same day for, at different times. Okay, so after completion of, uh, after 10 months, uh, I'll be uh, eligible for applying exam, right? Yes, yes. Hello? Yes, yes, you are right. Hello? Hello? Okay, and uh, sir, actually we are planning, we are actually we are five people uh -huh. planning uh, from, uh, right from Gujarat mm -hmm. to join for CC uh, next month. Mm -hmm. So I was just having one confusion that uh, what will be the total duration for the course so we could uh, plan further. Yeah, so it's around 10 months. 
Okay, around 10 months. And sir, one more question. Uh, that uh, may know uh, the, what is the exit, uh, as you shown the uh, opportunity for CCI security. Mm -hmm. But uh, I just want to know that what is the opportunity for CCI security out of country? I mean, out of India. Out of India, it is even uh, more, I would say, because uh, when you talk about Gulf countries and uh, uh, US, UK, Canada, at these places, you have they have a lot of requirement for uh, security engineers because all over the world, the requirement is same because every company in the world will require a security engineer to secure their network. So the demand is available globally and it is going to increase in future as well so no matter where you go you are if you have cc security with you and if you have good knowledge then you will, will always be in demand okay thank you sir right okay thank you very much sir all right Prakar? Hello. Yes. Hello. Yes, yes, please. Yes, sir. I am Prakar from Manpuri, UP. Yes, yes, please. Sir, uh, I want to know about the fee structure and duration of the course. Okay. Did uh, For which course you are talking about? Sir, I am talking about CCIE security. It is 10 months. Duration is 10 months. What the fee structure? Fee is 1,60,000. Okay, sir. And what the scope of the course, sir? Well, uh, scope is unlimited as far as uh, CCI security is concerned. It all see first of all you need to see how much you can learn out of the course so we are going to teach each and everything in CCI security but then you need to learn you need to do a lot of self-study whenever a new batch start I always tell this to student that we do not have a magic wand with us that okay you take an admission and then you become CCI security it doesn't happen like this you need to do a lot of self-study, you need to do a lot of practicals by your own, you need to spend a lot of time in the lab, learning a lot of things. Obviously, we are going to help you a lot, we are going to provide different classes for you, theory, theory classes, practical classes, PD classes. Yes, but sir. then if you do not come into the classes, if you are not regular or if you are not serious about studying, then obviously we cannot do anything about it. So it's all about how well you can study in the classroom and after the classrooms and uh, but please remember once you have good knowledge of cci security or security technologies the the limits are endless opportunities are endless because every company today needs a security engineer or a good or uh, they need a good security setup so the demand is there and it is going to increase multifold in future because Every company, whether it is an IT company or a non-IT company, every company has a network setup these days and every company needs to secure the network because yes, sir. every uh, company is offering the services 24 by 7 and that's why they need their network to be up and running and operational 24 by 7. So the demand is going to be huge. And as you can see, more and more companies are under attack. More and more networks are under yes, sir. attack. Sir, Recently, I want to know that the certification is must or not. Pardon? What did you say, Prakar? Prakar? Hello. Yes, what was your question? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, what, sir, tell me. What was your question? Yes, sir. I want to know, sir, what the what the importance of certifications, sir, as as the way I see or the salary packages. Uh huh. See, uh, so there are two kind of certification in uh, CCI, CCI Security Written, CCI Security Lab. So, CCI Security Written 
is obviously the stepping stone for uh, CCI lab. CCI security written alone is not going to help you a lot. But yes, CCI security lab is uh, very, very valuable. So if you have a CCI number with you, so obviously that will make a lot of difference in your career. So that number you can get even after the training or after getting some experience of one, two or three years. So that all that's all your choice based on your financial conditions. But yes, it makes a lot of difference. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Welcome. Yes, sir. Yes. Hi, sir. Yes, yes. Hi, sir. Are you able to hear me? Yes, yes. Please, please go ahead and ask your question. Sir, actually, I completed uh, 10CC NP routing and switching. Uh huh. If I go for CCIE, CCIE routing and switching version. By return and lab in your uh, training, uh -huh. will you give me placement for it? Yes, yes, we will give placements. Don't worry about that. Uh, okay, thank you. What is the uh, training cost for that uh, CC version 5 return plus lab exam? See, training cost, you can uh, get in touch with the sales team actually. They would uh, help you in that. I'm here to answer most of the technical or uh, career related queries. Right? Good afternoon. Hello. Yes, yes. Yes. So I want to know that there is an if I would go for CCI certification directly, I can go for CCI certification. I have to go to a step CCNA, CCNP. Uh, there is a schedule. I think that uh, you can go directly for CCI. Yes, yes. You can you can directly go for CCI security. So if you want to go for CCI security examination, you it's a two step process. So first of all, you will need to go for CCI. Security written exam and then the lab exam. So you don't need to go for any CC, any CCNP training or certification. Mr. Mehan, what you will give a dump for that for CCI security written questions and that? Yes, yes, every every assistance will be provided by us. And, uh, and, uh, and uh, Mr. Mehan, know that uh, if we are able to join for CCI uh, routing and switching, Mm -hmm. And there is an uh, also because um, maximum approximate is 60 to 70 percent labels are matching with CCI security also. Uh huh. Uh, Sitney routing and switching. Mm -hmm. And uh, what you will be give a session for that? Pardon? Uh, firstly, I want to go for CCI. There is a two exams CCI routing and switching uh -huh. and CCI security. Right? right, right. And CCI routing and switching and security. Mm -hmm. In both in both exams, there are approximate 60 to 70 percent labels. 60 to 70 percent syllabus formal, right? Mm -hmm. If I will go for both the certification, mm -hmm. uh, firstly I want to go for CCA routing and switching, right? And but uh, what will be concession for that? May I know? The uh, in in queries you need to send to the sales team. routing and switching. I would uh, just say that uh, uh -huh. it's not uh, feasible or it's not the right thing to do uh, two CCIs at the same time because uh, it becomes. Um, CCI is not an easy thing to do. You need to study a lot. So, doing two CCI at a time or back to back is not that easy. So, you need to focus at one CCI at a time. So, either you go for routing and switching or you go for security. So, don't go for two CCIs at the same time. And don't even take admission in two CCI at the same time. Go for only one thing at a time, either security or routing and switching. Can you suggest that currently I am working there is an... Um, where my work profile is for service operations, right? Mm -hmm. Right, my, my work profile service operation like this line will down there. Then, for what certification I have to do? She say routing and switching will be best or security will be best? Well, uh, there are two, two reasons, uh, two things uh, you need to see here. First is your interest that are you interested more in uh, routing and switching or security 
and two what is the requirement of your current job profile or if you want to make your changes in your job profile or if you want to upgrade yourself in security or what so accordingly you need to take this decision so if your job says your job requires that you need to be good in cci routing and switching then obviously cci routing switching should be your preferred choice but at the same time if you if you think that no you would like to become a security engineer rather than a routing and switching engineer and this is where your interest is then i would say go for cci security then you don't uh, look for whatever you are doing right now then you have to see your future where you would like to see yourself after after 2 years okay. that's the main question all right i can understand your your question but uh, may know that uh, personally that uh, if you will if you are give a If I will say that you judge that is the, there is a support for security is more than the routing switching is more uh, which you will give a preference. See, you scope wise, so obviously security has more scope when compared to routing and switching because uh, one, as you know, most more people do routing and switching. So that means when it comes to demand and supply gap, security has more and more demand and supply gap. So it is difficult to find. Uh, good security engineer but it is easy to find a good routing and switching engineer so demand is obviously go more for security and scope of growth salary everything is better in security field i would say security field there is too much scope yes yes as i have seen that on your website also there is a training schedule and period and i don't want to join i would like to join next weekend batch no so issues can, uh, most welcome most okay. welcome okay, so welcome ayush Ayush can you hear me Ayush can you hear me All right guys uh, that's all uh, from uh, this webinar i believe i have uh, answered all of the queries from uh, you people and it's been uh, amazing to interact with uh, you and uh, thank you very much for attending this webinar looking forward uh, to meet you in future thank you very much